Hey everyone, Shari here, and today's video is going to be another wash and go video. As you can tell, my hair looks amazing. This time I actually did a video very detailed to show you like how I got this hair. I'm actually very impressed with this hair because it is the first time that I can ever see this type of volume on the first day. As soon as my hair is completely dried, it never looks like this. It usually looks a little bit like more like tame. I like the tame look, but this has always been my favorite look. That being said, let's get into this video. Okay, I'm starting off this wash and go with freshly washed hair. If you haven't seen my shower routine, I'll leave that link below and above. So I'm just applying some of the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle to my hair before I actually do my wash and go. Now I'm just going to apply a shower cap over that. Since I will be sleeping with the product, I'm going to now have a towel on top of that so that it doesn't leak onto my pillow. After about two hours, I'm ready to rinse the product out. So as you can see, this is what my hair looks like now before I rinse it out. Now that it's all rinsed out, I am ready to apply my styling product, which is going to be a new product today. So I'm putting half of my hair up so that I can properly section my hair in the back when applying my product. The product that I'll be using is the Miss Jessie Honey Curls Defining Cream. So as you can see here, I am raking the product through with my fingers. I'm then going to brush the product through with my Michelle Mercier. I don't know if I said that correctly. It might be Michael Mercier, but that is the name of the brush that I use. Now after I'm done with that section, I'm just going to scrunch that lightly before I move on to the next section. This product does have a gel-like consistency, so after I felt how it felt on my hair, I was kind of not expecting much. I wasn't really happy with it, but I was hopeful. One thing I did notice about this product is that I didn't really have to coil the front of my hair like I normally do, which was a good thing. Now I'm just going through and scrunching my hair again before I actually start the drying process. So here's a trick that I like to do when I'm in a rush to dry my hair. I let my hair dry for about two hours and then I go ahead and I start diffusing. I noticed that if I diffuse too early, the product doesn't properly penetrate and do what it's supposed to do. It actually just sits on top of my hair, which is not good. I forgot to mention that I have the blow dryer on the lowest setting to prevent any frizz. Once I'm done diffusing, this is what my hair looks like. This is considered about 90% dry. In order to stretch my hair, I ended up taking two clips and separating my hair into two just to stretch the roots out. And here I'm just taking some Eco Styler flaxseed gel and I'm just taming my edges a little bit.
Now I'm just gonna take the clips out and then I'm going to go ahead and fluff my hair. Okay guys, so I'm not gonna lie to you. I did not expect this result from this product. I actually was very disappointed the moment that I felt the consistency of it because it was like a gel consistency. The end result just does not lie to you. This product obviously does a really good job at something. Then again, it could have a lot to do with my treatment prior to this because I don't do a treatment every time I do a wash and go. And I, I know for a fact that the Aussie always makes my hair a lot more spirally than normal. But obviously my hair still looks amazing so I don't know what to say. I mean, I can continue to give this product a try and then I will eventually figure out if it's the product or if it's the technique. I don't know what it is because, um, man, my hair, looks exactly how I would like my wash and go to look every time I do it without me having to wait three days for my hair to get this big. I can give a little credit to the stretching because the stretching may have made my hair this big, but at the same time, my hair feels very voluminous, like it feels bigger. So I don't know if it's the product or what, because I'm not even gonna lie, I felt like my hair was gonna come out like ramen as soon as I put the product through my hair. And I absolutely hate when my hair is like crunchy and hard and you can see through it. But as you can see, this is nowhere near crunchy. It feels like a pillow, but it also looks super defined at the same time. So, Leave your thoughts in the comments below. I would like to, I really like to hear your feedback. If you ever tried this product, what did it do to your hair? Did it give you these same results? I would love to hear from you guys. So hopefully I will see you guys in my next video.